to everything. The name came through changing the game, doing my thing in my own lane. Every time you see me, I'm hitting them switches. Started doing through something super vicious. Who is this? Mr. Everything's the name, came through changing the game, doing my thing in my own lane. Every time you see me, I'm hitting them switches, sliding through with something super vicious. Who is, Who is this? this? What's going on, everybody? It's Mr. Everything, bringing y'all low riders and horsepower, you dig? Rain, sleet, hell, snow, or shine, nothing, and no one stops to grind, not even the haters on the sidelines. And today, messing with the low rider again, about to show y'all the steps of what's going on with the, uh, you know, the frame process. Well, it's like crazy today, you know what I mean? Uh, go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. But if you have, thank you very kindly. Appreciate y'all feedback in the comment section, you know what I mean? And uh, just check out what I got. I'm just going step by step, you know what I'm saying? Watch to the end. Video ain't going to be that long. Just check it all out, you know. All right, now we out here. It's a little bit lighter, so it's a little bit better. Man, it get dusty so quick. Huh? Clean this stuff off. It's crazy. Once you get started on like trying to just keep your vehicle clean all together, it just seemed like, man, the dirtier it get, that's why I got to get me a spot with a, with a garage, you know? But here we go. A lot better looking. Not done yet. Going to get on some of that lower control arm as well. Um, Let's get started. I'm going to show y'all what it look like after I paint it. I'm going to do a little bit more cleaning and I'm going to go ahead and paint it. Alright, now, about to clean off the A-arm. If you look down here, you can see it looks a lot better. Starting to get down in there. Um, I probably will hit the greaser down there to get in there and probably get one of the wire brushes to work down in the spots where I can't get uh, with the uh, little wire brush sets and stuff here it is right here this little thing right there not nothing to be excited about but i'm telling you it's a lot better than using elbow grease you dig so i'm gonna clean all this off with some water and stuff and then spray it for paint because you know all of that uh the surface grease and things like that that got off still got a little bit down to here i'm gonna get that but I'm going to also get around that for now. It's going to go in stages. I'm just going to clean up what I can clean up and get it done how I can get it done. You know, it ain't got to be perfect, but hey, it's a little bit of something to keep some of the weathering from getting to so much of the frame. So, uh, I got this right here. I'm keep the bugs away, mosquitoes and all of that. It's not no incense. This is... You know what I'm saying? Some stuff to keep the bugs away for show. And they stay away as long as you stay close to the smoke. You separate yourself. That's show, uh, Mr. Postman. You know what I'm saying? When it cleaned off a little bit more, that's what it's looking like. Lower control arm. Still got to get down in there. And the frame is cleaned off as much as I can get it. I, this ain't going to be the only time. I, In the future... This body is going to come off, you know what I mean? And frame and all that stuff is going to be done 100% the right way. But for right now, since there's, you know, such a change in, you know, weathering in this area as far as winter time, you know what I'm saying, is spring, summer, fall, it, you know, takes a toll on everything. And I mean, this is in pretty good shape, you know, for the year that it is. So uh, I'm just trying to do more to preserve it in the meantime so it's time to at least add some paint right here all right and there it is with the coat that we got it's a little bit of drippage so i literally cleaned it off and then hit another little small coat but i'm not done because even though it seems like it might be backwards i'm just doing it all my way i don't care i just do it my way now right under here gotta finish the greasy i'm tired so I'm done for the evening, you dig? And then I will attack that lower control arm as well. Gotta get it clean, for real. Look at the front, pretty oily and everything down there. All that stuff is gonna get straight, trust me. I'm just doing it one step at a time, you dig? It's just my style. And as we take a step back, that's what it's looking like so far, you yeah, know. Looking good, I'm, I'm happy with it, you know? 
I'm really happy with it. It's my first time doing anything like this anyway, so this is not some professional job. This ain't something, you know, I've been doing for years. I just decided, you know what, I want to get this low rider cleaned up one step at a time, and we're going to, you know, start with this here. So that's where it's at. Looks good. I'm done for now. All right. Exhaust still giving me headaches as well. Now, originally, and I might put a clip in. Don't hold me to it, but originally, this exhaust, when I was running it, was running straight with the, you know, underneath, uh, you know, straight with the catalytic converter. I don't know how to explain it exactly, but my old piece was basically running up back there, so everything was kind of tucked away, because when I drop it down, it was coming down, and the muffler, I mean, was all the way, all the way on the ground. And it used to be, but I still got some way that I have to, uh, it's actually more sturdy now, but since I did run it up through there, uh, less of it is on the ground, but I still got to find some way to get this up just a little bit more to where when I drop the switch, when I dump it all the way, hit the switch and dump it all the way, I can still drive because before my exhaust made it to where I can still drive uh even with it all the way down but i necessarily can't right now so that's the dilemma i'm in but i mean it doesn't look bad for the way that i got it i just need to get it to get it tucked up some more uh, let me see if i can do it with my hand. see see that i need to bring it up i mean that little bit counts you might not think it does but that that right there is everything between being able to ride with the switch all the way down and hearing a light look, you know. I don't really want to hear that scraping sound, you dig, so. All right, y'all. Well, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. It's hot outside, for real, you know what I mean? Like, it's time to go in and enjoy the rest of the evening. Been a long day of work and all of that, you know what I mean? So, I appreciate y'all watching. Just uh, hang in there with me. We're going to get it done one step at a time. Uh, you could be anywhere watching anything, but you're right here watching Mr. Everything. You know, rain, sleet, hell, snow, or shine, nothing, and no one stops to grind. Not even the haters on the sidelines. I'm Mr. Everything, bringing y'all low riders and horsepower, you dig? Till next time, I'm out.